Scott, Janelle, I did this investigation 15 years ago. Crack pipes for sale at some West End convenience stores. Afterward, police cracked down and it went away. But recently, a convenience store manager right in the middle of a drugs and violence zone told me she gets cussed out almost daily now because she's one of the few who refuses to sell crack pipes to people. So we went back out with hidden cameras again to see what's really going on. Drugs and guns handed around like candy at 12th and Cedar in Louisville. Cash transactions, crack rocks doled out, often served up out of plastic baggies. Selling and smoking right out in the open, regardless of how many people or police may be nearby. It's brazen and it's violent. A man was shot to death in the same spot four hours after I stopped videotaping here. While neighbors walk by the crack deals and do nothing, we found neighboring convenience stores doing something about it. They're supplying the crack pipes, like shorties on Dixie. Have you got any uh, pipes? Never. Pipes? Like roses? Pipe? Yeah. Thank you. Walk in and use the right terminology a pipe, tube, rose, glass, or missile. You got, you got any roses? Yeah, roses. And the store clerk at 32nd in Kentucky will sell you a cylindrical glass crack pipe with a tiny fake flower inside to try to disguise it. Some stores, like Daily Mart on 18th, put it right out there. A wide array of more expensive, clear and colored pipes and bowls. Can I get this blue one right here? Right there, yeah. As well as the conventional crack pipes that cost a couple of bucks. Also, you got any, any tubes, roses? Roses, yeah. Some are more covert. What are the chances they'll sell me a crack pipe at Shorty's at 18th and Wilson with a police officer sitting at the door and other officers coming and going? Sure, you got a rose? Yeah. These aren't out in the open. They're in a drawer under the counter, and the clerk swiftly slips it into the same small brown bags the other stores use. They appear to know Kentucky law defines illegal drug paraphernalia as objects used in inhaling cocaine into the human body, such as glass, plastic, or ceramic pipes, with or without screens or tubes. After buying this stuff at all four of the stores we visited, it's pretty clear this isn't a fluke, so we go back with some questions. Doing a story on convenience stores selling crack pipes? I said, we're not sold this one in the store. Uh, we bought it from you, though, we, and we had a camera on at the time. When? Two days ago, in the morning, we came in here and bought a crack pipe from you and from many other convenience stores. No, not from him. Yeah, we did. We've got it on tape. I don't know. Do, I mean, do you know this is illegal? I don't know. I don't know. Sell it here in the store. That's it. Some workers don't deny selling them to me, but they deny knowing what they are. We're doing a story on convenience stores selling crack pipes to people. Do you know this is illegal? I never knew even what they use it for. So what did, what did you think they're used for? I have no idea. They just said they need a rose. So you don't know that these are crack pipes? No. Who you bought from here? Yeah, I bought it from right here. I bought this from behind the counter, and I bought this from the case right there, right? OK, this is uh, tobacco used, and they sell it all over in the uh, city here. Every place you go, they sell it. Every place we go, they sell for tobacco use? Yes. I mean, but let's be honest, this, this is a crack pipe. I don't know what they use it for. We sell it as a rose, and we buy from major company. We got a receipt for it. We don't buy it like from the street. We buy it from a company. And at Shorty's, where they sold me one with police on the premises, they first claim they don't sell them here. I bought it here from, I believe, this gentleman who just left the room over here. You bought it from him? Yes. We've got it on tape. Then the story changes. By the way, this is legal stuff. You buy it everywhere. Everywhere you buy This is legal? Yes. Everywhere you buy it. Have a good day. How do you figure this is legal? You buy it and you find it every gas station. Yeah, we found it at every single gas station. Now, the county attorney's office says they'll prosecute this if police bring charges. LMPD says they're aware, but not going after stores right now because the stores tell them they're selling art, at least those with the tiny flower inside. And they say one complicating issue is the paraphernalia law has been weakened in Kentucky, changed in 2010 to make every subsequent offense misdemeanors rather than increasing to class D felonies as they were before.